हेलो एंड गुड मॉर्निंग टू एवरीवन वेलकम टू एवरीवन टू आवर न्यू चैप्टर द नेम ऑफ द न्यू चैप्टर इट इज सम ऑफ द एप्लीकेशन ऑफ आवर ट्रिगोनोमेट्री एक्चुअली दिस चैप्टर इट इज द एल्डर ब्रदर ऑफ आवर ट्रिगोनोमेट्री चैप्टर इन द ट्रिगोनोमेट्री चैप्टर आवर डिस्कशन इट वाज जस्ट लाइक दिस व्हेनेवर इन एनी ऑफ द राइट एंगल ट्रायंगल केस इन एनी ऑफ द राइट एंगल ट्रायंगल केस whenever minimally two of its sides we are given minimally two sides we are given it may be these two side otherwise these two side otherwise these two side it may be given how to find out any of the trigonometric ratio but in this chapter basically our application it will be basically our application it will be whenever one of the Side it will be given whenever one of the side it will be given and any of the trigonometric ratio it is given any of the trigonometric ratio it will be given how to find out the another one it means single one it is given single angle it is given how to find out this one otherwise how to find out this one perfectly good perfectly good previous the situation it was side so we are given angle it was just but here it is a single side single angle it is given how to find out another side means this side otherwise this side and by using <coughs> by using this formula by using this formula also you can find out the height of any of the mountain whose real calculation it is impossible whose real calculation it is impossible but you can find out the height by using this procedure now i am giving you one of the example now i am giving you one of the example see perfectly suppose suppose this one it is one of the mountain suppose this one it is one of the mountain and its height it is not known to you suppose the height of the mountain it is our ab and it is not known to us the height it is how much also normally also really by using the rope also one cannot measure the height of the mountain it will be how much suppose now your position is listen suppose now your position is 5 km from the from the foot of the mountain foot of the mountain here this one it is your position see and this distance it is your 5 km this one it is your position suppose your position it is c and whenever you are watching the top of the mountain with an angle of 45 degree listen suppose you are watching and you are capable to see the top of the mountain you are capable to see the top of the otherwise tip of the mountain at an angle of 45 degree then after how you can find out the height of the mountain it will be how much this one it is one of the little application then after whenever we will go forward it means in our next question maximum questions are there maximum question on regarding its application see oh, always remember the formula always remember the formula so this one it is a single triangle case actually in this chapter the two things we will do the discussion one it is our single triangle case another one it will be our double triangle case so in this video i will do the example of few of the one triangle case also i will give the example of a few of the two triangles case then after we will do the exercise related question is it okay <clears throat> so for which always you have to give the importance then which one it is already given which side it is given which side it is given and which side it is axed which side it is axed means this side it is axed you have to make one relationship otherwise you have to try to formulate that trigonometric ratio which is the ratio of this side and this side see carefully for this angle this one it is the p for this angle this one it is our b so for which P B related trigonometric ratio it is our tan and cot 
either you may use the tan otherwise you may use the cut suppose i am feeling comfortable to use the tan so for which i just have to write just like this see carefully tan 45 degree it is our p means ab divided by bc understood this point this point it is the important point always you have to write that trigonometric ratio which can be expressible in the form of the which side it is given and which side it is asked <coughs> next one it is tan 45 means value you just have to put one and here it is a b it is not given a b it is not given but b c it is given that five kilometer i want a b so for which keeping a b on the right side rest of everything i am transposing to the left side one into 1 into 5 km 5 it is divided so for which I transpose to the left side so for which this one it is our 5 km it is our AB so it means finally I got the height of the the height of the the height of the mountain it is our 5 km AB it is our 5 km easy or difficult understood now suppose instead of a 45 degree suppose here it is given that 30 degree Suppose it is given that 30 degree. See how to find the same. 30 degree means the same. Here it is the P and B related. So for which you need to write it as tan 30 degree. It is our AB divided by BC. As tan 30 degree it is our 1 by root 3. For which it is our AB divided by BC means 5 kilometer. In the next step. A B it is our 5 divided by root 3 kilometer. Ready? Perfectly understood. So this related few of the book question I am attempting. So from there you will be sure whenever the question it will be related to a single triangle, single right angle triangle related question it will come you have to solve just like this so we have to take attempt whether the trick it is perfectly working are there or not see one of the question it means our first question of our exercise it is given see in one circus in one circus this one it is the pole this one it is the pole and with the top of the pole here it is one of the rope it is fixed rope it is fixed and the length of the rope it is our 20 meter this one it is the pole this one it is the rope this rope it is perfectly fixed no loose is there in the rope so for which the rope it is tightly fixed it is at here fixed it is at here and here it is given that the angle of inclination here it is given that the angle this one it is the ground this one it is the angle of inclination with the ground it is our 30 degree angle of inclination with the ground it is given that 30 degree and it is asked you have to find out the height of the pole it is asked you have to height of the pole suppose i am naming a this one it is our b this one it is our c you need to find out and uh, uh, means height of the pole and always i said always i said you have to give the focus which side it is given and which side it is asked for this angle for this angle it means this one it will be our p and this one it will be our h so it means you have to consider that trigonometric ratio which can be formed by the ratio of this one and this one it means p this one it is our h it means p and h related trigonometric ratio it is our either it will be our sine otherwise it will be our cosec either you can use the sine otherwise you may use the cosec but here i am using the sine sine 30 degree it is our p means a b h it means it is our ac <coughs> then after in the next next case you have to put the value only sin 30 degree it is our 1 by 2 and here it is a b it is axed and here it is a c it is our 20 meter then after you have to solve actually i want the a b 
so for which ab you have to keep separate and here it is 1 by 2 here it is 20 divided in the next step 20 it is to be multiplied so for which 20 meter into 1 by 2 on cancellation it will give us 10 meter it implies 10 meter it is our ab so it means finally i got ab it is our 10 meter so tell me whatever the formula I said to you, otherwise whatever the trick I have said to you, whether the same formula is it working or not, understood? Now we will do this related another question, ready? Here it is one of the tree, one of the tree it is there, see carefully, this one it is the tree it is given and in one of the storm, the tree has been broken from some of the height. From some of the height, the tree has been broken. Suppose the tree has been broken at this point and this much part, it has been broken and it has been inclined with this angle. Understood? So this much part has been broken and has been fixed on the <coughs> ground. And here it is the top of the tree. It touches the ground. It touches the ground. And here it is given that from the foot of the tree, from the foot of the tree, the top of the tree, the distance of the, <coughs> the distance of the top of the tree, it is our 8 meter. It means suppose the tree it is our A, this one it is our tree, the height of the tree it is our AB. And the tree has been broken at the point of a C and it touches the ground at the point of a D. And from where it touches the ground, this distance from the foot it is our 8 meter. And once it is given that the tree has been, <coughs> has, has touched the ground with an angle of inclination, it is our 30 degree. With the inclination angle of 30 degree, it is inclined to the ground. So here it is asked, you have to find out the height of the tree. You have to find out the height of the tree. See carefully, height of the tree means, height of the tree means this height plus this height. It means I need to find out this length and this length. Otherwise, whenever I can find out AC and BC, AC and BC, then after I can find out the height of the tree by adding AC plus BC. <coughs> and another thing you just have to see, BC, BC, it is also same as CD. Because the which broken part, it is, it is, it is broken from here, it is being fixed at here. So for which this broken part, it is also same as this broken part. So for which, for which the height of the tree, it is equal to C, AC plus BC, which is same as AC plus CD. So it means two things I want to find, AC, another one it is our CD. Because BC here directly I cannot find. So BC I cannot find. It means in the right angle triangle. In the right angle triangle. I can find out this one. Also I can find out this one. Because I said once. One of the trigonometric ratio it is given. And any of the side it is given. How to find out the other sides. First we have to give the target to this side. First we have to give the target to this side. See. <coughs> forget this one. Now you have to forget this one and my formula says whenever which angle it is given, this one it is the angle it is given, this one it is the side it is given, always you have to give the importance, always you have to give the importance to that side which one it is given, it means this one it is given and also which one it is asked, asked means this one. So for this angle, this one it is the P and this one it is the B. So for which I said you have to write down that trigonometric ratio which having the relationship with P and B. P and B means both tan and cut for which I am feeling comfortable to write with the tan. So for which I am writing just like this tan 30 degree. See tan 30 degree otherwise writing it is at here tan 30 degree tan 30 degree it is our P by B. P means SC. B means it is our AD. Which implies in the next step you have to put the value. 10 30 degree it is our 1 by root 3. 
and our AC it is not given and AD it is given it as the 8 meter. By solving you will get it as the AB it is our 8 divided by root 3 meter. So it means finally I got our AB it is our 8 by root 3 meter. Next one it is actually I got this one. This one I have already got. This one already got. Next one it is how to find out this side. How to find out this side. See previous case you totally have to forget. Previous one totally you need to forget. Now I have to give the importance to which one it is given and which one it is axed. Axed means this one it is axed. So we have to find out which trigonometric ratio sets the relationship between for this angle this one it is the B and this one it is the H. So which one says the relationship between the B and H? Definitely cos, cos and sec but I am feeling more comfortable to write with the cos. So for which I am writing cos 30 degree. It is our B by H. B by H means AD. H means CD. Which says cos 30 degree it is our root 3 divided by 2. It is our AD means 8 meter divided by CD. CD it is in the denominator. So for which it means by doing the cross multiplication root 3 into CD. It is our 8 meter into 2, which implies I want CD. So for which CD it is your 16 meter divided by root 3. It means previous, previous one I got the AB. Now I got the CD and I said on adding AB with CD you can find out the height of the tree. Actually height of the tree means AB. Height of the tree it is our AB. AB it is equal to AC plus BC. But AC plus BC means BC it is also same as CD. So in the next step only you have to put the value. AC it is our AC. <coughs> AC it is our. This one it is AC. This one it is C. This one it is C. This one it is C. By mistakenly I have continued it with B. Here it is AC. So for which AC it is our 8 by root 3 meter and here it is 16 by root 3 meter. So for which I can write it as the denominator, denominator both are same. Numerator 16 plus 8 it is equal to 24 divided by root 3 meter. Otherwise I may simplify just like this. 24 here it is denominator it is root 3. Also root 3 multiplied to make the rationalization of the denominator which becomes 24 divided by 3 3 into root 3 meter 3 will cancel the 24 which becomes our 8 root 3 meter so the last two discussed question both were our single triangle formed question but now I am going to do the discussion of one of the question. Which question related to our two triangle related question? Okay, two triangle related question. How to solve? Also, now I am going to give you. Okay, before we have to do the two triangle related question, two term I want to say to you. One it is our angle of elevation. Another one it is our angle of depression. See, suppose. Suppose here I am standing, suppose here I am standing, see carefully, and here it is my eyes, here it is my eyes, see carefully, suppose here it is my eyes, <coughs> and here it is the ground, here it is the ground, see, in which angle, suppose I am looking straight, I am looking straight, and my vision, my vision it is just like a parallel with the ground, whenever I am looking with this direction and here it is the ground whenever both the lines are parallel to one another. So this line it is called as our normal. What it is called? This one it is called as the normal. So here it is called as our looking line in which line I am looking, looking forward so that this line it is parallel to this one. It means straight. This one it is the straight. So for which this one it is called my normal. 
and suppose here it is the object suppose here it is the object which is at a higher position of the normal so in which line i am seeing that object whenever i am seeing that object which which line that line makes the angle with the normal it is how much that one it is called as your angle of elevation this one it is called as your angle of elevation perfectly good and another thing you just have to remember another thing remember whenever any of the object which is lower than the normal lower than the normal previously it is higher than the normal higher than the normal angle formed with the normal it is called as our angle of elevation and here it is angle <coughs> whenever the object it is at a lower height of the normal so here the angle formed with the normal it is called as our angle of depression so this one it is called as our angle of depression one it is called as our angle of elevation and here it is two it is called as our angle of depression perfectly good perfectly good this point see now i am showing to you how to do the next question two triangle related question how to solve see here it is in the two triangle related question the question it is given just like this here it is one of the building it is given and the height of the building it is our 7 meter <coughs> height of the building it is our 7 meter and here it is <coughs> here it is one of the tower it is given here it is the ground here it is the ground here it is the tower it is given and here it is given that and here someone is seeing the top of the tower with angle of elevation it is 60 degree angle of elevation it is 60 degree angle of elevation means 100% the normal it will be there so it means this one it is its normal and here it is the angle of elevation it is our angle of elevation it is our 60 degree angle of elevation it is our 60 degree suppose the height of the building i am naming it as the ab and the tower i am naming it as the c this one it is our d and this one it is the normal normal intersect cd at the point of e suppose and here it is the angle of elevation it is our 60 degree and from that <coughs> that build, building point it means from that top of the building whenever one is looking the foot of the tower foot of the tower foot of the tower here the angle of depression see here the angle of depression it is our 45 degree it means this angle it is our 45 degree so you have to find out so you have to find out the height of the tower it is how much you have to find out the height of the tower it is how much height of the tower means you have to find out this much this distance it will be how much remember always whenever two triangles related question it will come whenever two triangle related question it will come always you have to try to find out which one it is the common common side between them common side between them see here this one it is the common side the common side it is called as our ae which i will consider it as the mediator you just have to consider the common side between the two triangles as our mediator then after see here it is 7 cm 7 7 meter it means this one it is the normal this one it is 7 meter means this one it is also 7 meter it means this one it is our 7 meter understood this one it is 7 it means this one it is the 7 because this one it is the normal means 90 degree it means 90 degree so it means just like it is one of the figure of a rectangle and this distance it is how much this distance how much this distance also that much this length it is how much also this length it is also that much so for which 7 meter means this one it is 7 meter see to find out the height to find out the height actually we have got this much if i can find out only this much if only i can find out only this much by adding by adding 7 meter with this length i can say it as the height of the it as the height of the tower understood so for which listen for which our mediator it is a so it means here it is a and here it is this one it is given so for this angle for this angle this one it is the p this one it is the b so by using p and b from this triangle i can define one of the trigonometry ratio 
I can find out one of the trigonometry ratio it is at here. And for the another triangle, another triangle, which one it is the common? Common one it is this one. See, common one it is this one. It means which one it is the common one and which one it is the axed one by using that two side also you have to define another trigonometric ratio. It means two things I said. In one triangle, one triangle, you have to just see which one it is the common side which one it is the given side by using these two side one of the trigonometric ratio you have to define in this triangle and in the another triangle which one it is common which one it is axed you have to define another trigonometric ratio it means two things i said in one triangle which one it is given given common trick remember given and common one trigonometric ratio Another one it is common and axed. Common and axed. Another trigonometry ratio. Actually, in the previous one tri triangle related question, only it was said to you given and axed. But here it is with given, common it is added, and here it is with axed also common it is added. So for which in this situation two triangle related question also we have to consider two trigonometric ratio. See, first trigonometry ratio, it is the given and common, given and common, see, given and common, given means here it is the P for this angle, this one it is the P and this one it is the B, so P, B related, it means tan, so for which here I am writing tan 45 degree, it is our P means CE divided by A, tan 45 degree, it is our 1, CE means it is our given 7 meter and here it is A, it is given it as our A, it is not given, A, it is not given, which implies C, which implies it is not given, so not given it is how much, not given it is how much, C, by doing the cross multiplication, A, it is our 7 meter. A, it is our 7 meter. First case ready. First case ready. Another thing I am repeating. Always you have to express the common side. It will be how much. Common side A, it is how much. Also in the second triangle, also our common side, it will be how much. See, in the second triangle, in the another triangle, here it is the triangle case of the, in the triangle A, E, C. In the triangle A, E, C. Now in triangle a E D in the triangle A E D. See here also trigonometric ratio. I have to consider between the which one it is common and which one it is axed. Common means axed means P and common means adjacent side it is our B. So for which P B related here it is also tan 60 degree. Tan 60 degree it is our P means it is our D E and B means it is our A. I said here common side it is how much A, here it is also in the same way I have to find out A. But in the next step we have to put the value tan 60 degree it is our root 3, it is our DE divided by A. Which implies A into root 3, it is our DE which says A it is our DE divided by root 3. So it means here I got A it is equal to 7 meter and here I got A it is equal to D by root 3. Make it as the equation 1 and make it as the equation 2. From the two equation, from the equation 1 and equation 2, here you have to write from equation 1 and 2 right side it will be same as the right side. It means DE divided by root 3, it is our 7 meter. As I want for the DE, so for which I have to write it as DE, it is our 7 root 3 meter. Understood? So it means I got it as the DE, it means DE, it means this distance, it is our 7 root 3 meter. 
आज इट इज एक्स टू फाइट ऑफ द हाइट ऑफ द टावर हाइट ऑफ द टावर मीन्स सी डी हाइट ऑफ द टावर मीन्स सी दिस वन इट इज यूर डी एंड सी डी इज द सम ऑफ सी ई प्लस डी एंड हियर इट इज सी ई इट इज अवर सेवेन मीटर एंड डी इट इज अवर सेवेन रूट थ्री मीटर सो बाय टेकिंग सेवेन इट एज द कॉमन वन कैन राइट इट एज द वन प्लस रूट थ्री मीटर अदरवाइज वन कैन राइट द सेम सेवेन सेवेन प्लस सेवेन प्लस रूट थ्री मीटर I hope you understood this question. And in this question, two triangle related question. First trick: remember, you have to find out the triangle. You have to find out the two triangles. You have to find out the two triangles. You have to choose the two triangles in such a way. Here it is the given one, common one. Next one it is common one, asked one. And always you have to express here the in this side the common it is equal to how much. Here it is common. It is equal to how much? So common, common. Here it is right side, right side. You have to equate. You can find out the next one. You can find out the next one. I hope you understood this question. Now we will do the another question on related to our two triangles related question. Ready? See here it is another two triangle related question. It is given, and in that two triangle related question, here it is given that. Here it is one of the watch tower, otherwise light house. It is given one of the light house. It is given and the height of the light house. It is our seventy five meter. The height of the light house. It is our seventy five meter. And someone is observing from the height of the, otherwise from the top of the light house. And here two ships are coming. Here it is one ship and here it is another ship. Two ships are coming, and one ship, another ship, both are <coughs> one after. It means one it is the <coughs> one it is in the back side of the another one. It means both are in the same line, both are in the same line. And whenever I am watching this one, so <coughs> see, so whenever I am watching this one, it means this one the parallel line with the ground. This one it is the ground. With the <coughs> the parallel line with the ground, this one it is called as our normal. This one it is our normal. Ready? And here it is the here it is the angle of a depression of one of the ship it is our 30 degree. Another one it is our 45 degree. See, 30 degree means the angle it is the smaller angle. See, here it is the one angle of a depression. Angle of a depression this one. Another one it is here it is angle of a depression of the another one. See, as here it is clearly seen, clearly seen. This one it is the smaller one for which this one it is our thirty degree, and this one it is our larger one for which this one it is our forty five degree. Now I want to name it the lighthouse. Name it is suppose A. This one it is our B. One C. It is our C. Another one it is our D. And it is asked to you that you have to find out the distance between the two ships. The distance between the two ships. It means you need to find out to DC. It is asked you have to find out the distance between the two ships. Otherwise, you have to find out the DC. It will be how much? See, whenever two lines are parallel to one another. This angle it will always be same as this angle because of our interior alternate angles. In the same way, remember whenever this angle it is forty five degree, it means this angle it is our forty five degree because this angle and this angle both are our interior alternate angles. And here it is this angle it is thirty degree. It implies this angle it is also our thirty degrees. Perfectly good. So here, here we will apply the trick. Everyone see here the trick is just like this. See, always I said in the two triangles, always you have to find out. Always you have to find out in the two triangles. Always you have to find out the common side. See here it is two triangles. One it is our ADB. Another one it is our ACD. Both are our right angle triangles. And in the right angle triangle. Our common side it is our 75 meter, otherwise AB. So it means this one it is our common side. Here the common side which one it is also that side it is also our given one. 
इट मीन्स कॉमन एंड गिविन बोथ आर सेम कॉमन एंड गिविन बोथ आर सेम एंड व्हिच वन इट इज द एक्स्ट साइड हियर दिस साइड इट इज आवर एक्स्ट साइड सी एक्स्ट साइड इज दिस साइड एक्चुअली दिस वन इट इज एक्स्ट इट मीन्स आई एम कंसीडरिंग दिस साइड टोटल इट इज द एक्स्ट साइड बिकॉज ओनली दिस वन इट इज एक्स्ट बट आई एम कंसीडरिंग टोटल वन इट इज आवर एक्स्ट साइड सो फॉर व्हिच फॉर व्हिच फॉर दिस एंगल इट मीन्स दिस वन इट इज आवर पी दिस वन इट इज आवर बी and for this angle also this one it is the p and the larger one it is our b so for which for this angle i have to find out the trigonometric ratio which relates this one with this one so for which i am writing in triangle in triangle abc P and B related, it means it is our tan 45 degree. Tan 45 degree, it is our AB divided by BC. AB divided by BC, which implies tan 45 means one. AB it is our 75 meter and BC it is our not given. So for which I am writing it as the BC. so here it is the unknown one it is bc i want to find bc by doing the cross multiplication it becomes our 75 meter it means bc it is our 75 meter actually why i am interested to find out the bc actually whenever i am getting the bc it is equal to 75 meter and whenever i will get the total one from the total whenever i will do the subtraction of a bc i can find out the bc actually i want to find out the dc from the total if i will subtract this much it means i can find out this much <coughs> here bc it is equal to this much in the next triangle see in the next triangle adb in triangle adb right angle triangle adb here it is also this one it is given this one it is the axed side so for which p this one it is the b so for which here i am writing tan 30 degree it is our ap divided by for this 30 degree means total triangle so here it is the b it is our db which implies tan 30 degree it means it is our 1 by root 3 which is our ab means 75 meter divided by db and by doing the cross multiplication here i can find out db it is our 75 into root 3 meter so it means db i got see the total one i got it as the, the total larger one it is our 75 root 3 meter and this one it is our this one it is our 75 meter as i want to find out see as i want to find out dc here i am writing see carefully as i want to find out dc and dc it is equal to db minus bc for which db it is our 75 root 3 and bc it is our 75 both are in meter so for which by taking 75 it as the common within the bracket root 3 minus 1 into meter so the distance between the two shifts is 75 whole into root 3 minus 1 meter so today the discussion it is this much so in our next discussion video we will do the discussion of extra question okay thank you have a nice day bye bye